most prevalent oxides of nitrogen are nitrogen dioxide and nitric oxide. Both are toxic gases, with nitrogen dioxide being a highly reactive oxidant and corrosive. The primary sources indoors are combustion processes such as unvented combustion appliances, vented appliances with defective installations, welding, and tobacco smoke. Average levels in homes without combustion appliances is about half that of outdoors. In homes with gas stoves, kerosene heaters, or unvented gas space heaters, indoor levels often exceed outdoor levels. Health effects associated with nitrogen dioxide include eye, nose, and throat irritation. It may also cause impaired lung function and increase respiratory infections in young children. Continued exposure to high nitrogen dioxide levels can contribute to the development of acute or chronic bronchitis. Low-level nitrogen dioxide exposure may cause increased bronchial reactivity in some asthmatics, decreased lung function in patients with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, and increased risk of respiratory infections, especially in young children. Steps to reduce exposure in the home include venting the nitrogen dioxide sources to the outdoors and assuring that combustion appliances are correctly installed, used, and maintained. It is important to minimize indoor occupants' exposure to nitrogen dioxide and other indoor air quality contaminants. To learn more about environmental, remediation, and indoor air quality issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.